Well, good evening wherever you are on this most pleasant evening. As you can see, there's been a, a terrific atmosphere here. There is great expectation, excitement, and it has built nicely in these idyllic conditions, conditions which are certainly playing their part in creating a glorious ambience. It's quite a struggle to get in here, points of access hard to come by and an awful lot of people gathering to get through the gates, but regardless of that, there's a great feel here and much excitement for the game ahead. So red and white, of course, the preeminent colours at Old Trafford, which is now officially the largest club football ground in England, its capacity 75,000 and growing. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. We have already started here. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Coutinho. He's a, a real magician with a wand of a right foot. His control is, is brilliant and he can pick out a through pass with the very best in the world. He's also scored plenty of long-range efforts in his time too, so defences will need to be sure not to give him time to line up a shot. OK, interesting. And he shoots! And he nearly went all the way. Well, we can't question the quality of the run. He'll have to answer for the rest. Chance to break. Well played, he saw that coming. And he's managed to get rid. Forwards and with intent. Ter Stegen can pick that up. Sergio Roberto. Well seen, saw that coming. Fred. Now looking to orchestrate a counter. Good spot, he's seen the run. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's had it! Oh, so close to what would have been a memorable goal. Oh, after such a great run, I'm expecting him to go all the way, and instead, he just lost his way. Moved on forwards. Coutinho. Philippe Coutinho, lovely feet. McTominay gets a foot in here. McTominay did just about enough to come out on top there. Neither party overly willing to compromise. And we've reached half-time, so neither team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now but still goalless. Those of you making their way home on public Manchester United today, head to the dressing room, the not yet having broken through. Tight cage again. And team, please any welcome further our lads forward to the they were when they started out. And we're off again. No score in the first half, who's ready to go for it now? Now there's a chance! Now the counter. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. He's left his man. That's great strength on the ball. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! What a wonderful goal! Boom! There we go, and it couldn't be much better. He was born for the glory he's just managed. The apple on top of the tree. 
And that really is so, so impressive. Yeah, and having the thrust it's to get goal. there is one Thank thing. You. Having the composure to score After is another. 53 minutes is number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. So here comes the substitution. Substitution in progress. Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. That's firm, and more pertinently, the it's fair. The attendance for this match was 72,306. Oh no, no circumventing this opponent. Greenwood gets into a dangerous position. Gets away from his opponent. Played in with loft. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. This is a really front-footed approach. Well, the question now is whether they can sustain it. taking place. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. De Jong. Interesting ball. You can never be short of runners into space, as long as the space left behind is filled. Showing good feet. Well, he's looking at the referee, but the referee is shaking his head. And the counter is on. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? And that interception was most necessary. He's found his man. Has a goal! And that will surely go down as one of the easiest goals he could ever score. Well, the finish looked a guarantee once he was found all alone, and it's criminal defending. After 81 minutes is... Number 7, Cristiano Ronaldo! Barcelona are making a change now. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. So that's two now without reply. And it's Coutinho. Well positioned to make that interception. Sends it forward. Four added minutes has been indicated. And here's Coutinho. Moved forward and quickly so. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And that is that. Now the manager heads down the tunnel, swathed in satisfaction. And his team have carried out his instructions to the word. And they have got their win. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? What I most admire about this outfit is the cohesion and the willingness to work hard as a unit and getting behind the ball. Doing the ugly stuff, that's what gets you clean sheets and wins. And, and with that, it's time for me today. to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening. The entrance gate. Thank you very much.